One day my therapist said to me, you are open to discussing your race, you are open to discussing your bisexuality, but you never talk about your five years at Eton College. You always seem to skim over it. Given that so many of Britain's prominent political figures attended my boarding school, I have decided it is time to stop skimming, and that is why I'm writing this book. I had a great education there and made many great friends. At the same time, I have often wondered why a place that was so good for me seems to be part of the harm that has been done to our country. When I look back at my teenage years, I see the roots of two modern trends, which largely seemed unthinkable back then. When I look at my time at Eton, I see the genesis of Brexit. When I look at my time growing up in a small suburb in Greater London, I see the rise of the far right. My new book, How to Avoid Detection, will attempt to examine both. Anyone who has ever read my work knows that it's often very personal. At the same time, I'm frightened to write this because in many ways, I'm still a very private person. But I think that I need to write this because I do not think that we can understand modern Britain without an intimate exploration of race and the class. I have always believed that to understand where we are going as a society, we need to understand how we got here. And so this book will be my contribution to that conversation. There are times when this book will be angry. There are times when it will be affectionate, but I can promise that it will always be honest. I hope you will find it of interest.